Remember that feeling when you were a kid and you had that slinky and you let it roll down the stairs? And when it got to the bottom, how elated you were and how awesome it felt. It was like, yes, I made it to the bottom. But we all also had, you know, there was the two types. You had the metal ones, you had the plastic ones. We all knew the plastic ones sucked because they didn't have the weight. But, well, I mean, they still suck. But hey, check this out. How about a 3D printed slinky? It already fell off the bed, but maybe it didn't. Maybe it just cracked a little bit. But check this out. It's a 3D printed slinky. Let me get it off. The, uh oh, let me get it off the bed and see what happens. Now, supposedly this is cut in a certain way that you could just slice it. But actually, I'm finding that I can just pull it apart and I'll just keep going. See if this works. It's actually kind of satisfying. And just like that, it's all done. How cool is that? A 3D printed slinky. Now let's go find a set of stairs and see if it works. But of course, before we find stairs, we have to do this. How many hours were spent as a child or as an adult doing this? Okay, I gotta stop. Believe it or not, it actually works. One question, should I print a massive one? Or at least want to fill this bed? What do you think?